Hello, Chris East, and welcome back for another exciting school year, the 2021 school year. My name is Sean Kelly, I'm the principal. For those of you that know me, welcome back. And for the freshmen that are coming in, we're excited to have you here. It's gonna be a fantastic school year. Welcome to the best high school in the state of Rhode Island. This video is gonna give you a little bit of an introduction to some of the things that are around here. For those of you that are familiar with our campus, you're going to be able to see some of the new things that we have set up for you in the socially distanced world that we now live. For the freshmen, this will become something that's completely normal to you because you haven't had the chance to experience it yet. Again, please watch the video, find out what we're talking about, and we're really excited to have you back. Welcome back and welcome to the best high school in the state of Rhode Island. Welcome back everyone, we can't wait to see you. Have a great year everybody. Welcome back Cranston East, can't wait to see you. Hola jóvenes, bienvenidos a Cranston East, un poco diferente, pero aquí estamos, bienvenidos. Hi, welcome back. Welcome back, have a great year. Welcome back everybody, can't wait to see you. Welcome back Cranston East. Welcome back everybody. Hey guys, it's Mrs. Bettencourt, we can't wait to see you. Welcome back Cranston East. Hi, my name is Isa Tejada. I'm the Dean of Students at Cranston East High School, and I would like you to welcome you to this school year. I would like you to come with me for a little tour of what the school looks like this year. When you get to school, make sure that you have your mask on, and also make sure that you do not enter if you have a cough or a fever. Come with me. start at 7.30, so you will not be allowed in the building until 7.30. Remember, this is our orchestra entrance, and you can also access the building from here. Once you are inside the building, please pay attention to the signs around the school indicating which way the hallways are going. It's very important that you follow the pattern to make sure that we are complying with the social distance requirements. The same goes for stairways. Please make sure that you follow the signs on the stairs. I bet you want to know what a classroom is going to look like in this new era. So this is going to be for every classroom. Yes, you notice there are marks on the floor. Every desk is six feet apart. And that's how it has to remain. Every desk must be facing forward, and that's how it has to remain. So please make sure that once you sit down, you do not move the desk around. That's for your safety and our, the safety of everyone in the school. Every room has the same setup. All the desks are facing forward, and they are six feet apart from each other. As you can see, this is our main cafeteria. Every student is going to be assigned to a particular uh, desk, and that's where you will be eating your lunch. If you buy lunch or if you get lunch from the school, there will be grab and go stations before you come down to the cafeteria. And this is again, one of the places where you can also eat your lunch. As you can see, we have transformed our gym to make sure that we can accommodate our students for health classes and also as one of the lunch sites. This space, formerly known as the senior cafeteria, will also be used for lunch purposes. Again, this is not going to be exclusively for uh, seniors. This will be for everyone as we assign them. You need to remember that you're going to have an assigned seat and it's important for you to remain seated the whole time. Our garden office is located in the third floor and you are going to come here only if you have an appointment with your guidance counselor. As you can see, we have removed all the furniture from the guidance so you cannot come and hang out here. Again, you must make a guidance appointment with your counselor using the Aspen account. Also, I want to point out that we have dispensers all over the school for you to use at your convenience. 
once you are outside, if you have glasses and bricks, or if your teachers are taking you down for a mask break, you can remove your mask until you get to the next building. Now we are in the bricks building. Remember, once you get to bricks, you gotta put your mask back on before you enter the building. So we are inside of bricks. Again, the staircases are going to be a one way. In the past, if you had classes in bricks, you had lunch downstairs in the bricks cafeteria. That's not going to be happening this year. Everyone is going to be having lunch in the main building. The nurse office is located in the second floor in room 207. If you need to see the nurse, you must have a pass from your teacher or one of the administrators. There will be a triage area here where someone is going to ask you for your symptoms. Please remember to bring water to school. Either buy your water bottle, it's my favorite so we can help the environment, or buy some water. This will not be available. Please remember to bring water to school. Every day you will be dismissed by floors. We are going to start around 150 to make sure that every student is following the six feet apart social distancing. We are encouraging you to just get on the bus or walk home. There will be no socializing after school in the school grounds. Bienvenidos a Cronsonese, chicos. We are waiting for you. You're going to have an amazing year. See you soon. Thank you. Hola, bienvenidos a Cronsonese. Los esperamos. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back, guys. It's going to be a great year. Welcome back, everybody. I hope that you find this video, video useful. We are excited and ready to have you back. It's going to look different, but the support and the love that we have for our Thunderbolts is still the same. Welcome to the best high school in the state of Rhode Island. Go Thunderbolts!